What's up everyone? Today is Monday, August 3rd at 8.02 a.m. Gonna do a video watch this today. Uh, so a couple things I wanna make note of is our two year anniversary event is coming up. So at myinvestingclub.com slash anniversary, you can reserve your spot. This is gonna be a live trading event. Uh, so I'm gonna talk about uh, how to build a watch list, how it's gonna trade live. There's gonna be presentations from moderators. There's gonna be giveaways. Uh, it's gonna be a cool uh, event. So. Usually we do these events in person, but due to the kind of pandemic that's been going on, we're gonna go virtual this year. Uh, and because of virtual, there's gonna be limited seating. So we're already at about 70% capacity for the ticket sales. Uh, so in about a week or two weeks, uh, we are going to raise the price and space is gonna run out. So if you wanna attend, click here and reserve your spot. And you lifetime members, there's a section in chat for you guys to reserve your spot. So yeah, let's get started. Um, Kodak. So. Obviously, we're on the backside of the move now. It did its big move, now it's pulling back. Now we could look to short pops on a bounce. Uh, yeah, it kind of went up to 25, 26 today, but you know, on something like this, I feel like there's so much like headline risk, there's so much like algorithmic trading risk that you know, I kind of want to wait till it goes like maybe even 30 bucks or something, something crazy, right? So I'm just gonna kind of keep this on watch for the coming days and let it do its thing. SONN, so this is kind of a crazy stock. This was a stock that was pumped up uh, by a chat room pumper. They were pumping it up all over here. This was all them pumping, pumping, pumping. And then as soon as they stopped pumping, boom, and then it faded all day. So this is also something to kind of make note of and keep reminder of is that, you know, we are in a market where there's pumpers everywhere. And you got everyone with a screen share, a text message, email, signals, all this shit. And the way that those work is the guy in charge, the guru makes all the money and then all the members, all the subscribers lose all their asses. Guru's buying a seven saying that nine, 10, 11 is gonna come and then out of nowhere fucking three, four, five comes. So that gives us an edge guys. So every single day I'm looking at what stocks these pumpers are pumping and then waiting for them to leave to see if there is still an opportunity on these stocks. So just keep that in mind. But anyway, on something like this, I'm looking to short a pop towards, you know, red to green or 450 and five bucks. Again, draw your lines on something like this. ACH, what the fuck? ACHV. Uh, this one, I'm gonna keep it, oops, pretty simple. I see a line towards 15. So I see this resistance here, resistance here. So looking for a bounce towards 15 to short, hopefully. DPW, uh, the stock already tanked pre-market, topped out. So again, keeping it simple, looking for the half dollar mark 350 and then looking to short around 370s, 380s if we get there. HIHO is also broken. I mean like shit. All right, I mean like $6 is VWAP and whole dollar resistance. So that would obviously be the perfect entry, but we might have to settle for like 550 or 580s in the morning. Uh, I'm not gonna chase weakness here. I'm basically just gonna wait for it to do its thing. CBA, this is the potential hot chick of the day. Uh, this stock is easy to borrow and it is making new highs pre-market. So this is one that I'm kind of hoping that takes the attention away from HIHO. Uh, again, I'm gonna keep it very, very simple. Don't really wanna mess around on Mondays. A lot of people have FOMO because of the weekend, so I'm just gonna try to stay safe, try to stay patient, uh, and hopefully this HIHO passes. Uh, again, guys, gonna be doing a YouTube Live recap today at 11. Uh, please reserve your spot for the event. Again, we are at 70% capacity. We could only guarantee the seats for the annual and lifetime members and the ticket holders, so please reserve your spot. And I think that's it, guys. So let me see if there's anything else moving. I think that's it. So uh, that's it, guys. Also, what I want to do is at the end of the video, instead of doing a secret word, I want you guys to reply with one thing that you did over the weekend to help improve your process for today. It could be watching videos, it could be talking to your tab. Uh, just curious what you guys are doing on the weekend to prepare for the day today. So thanks, and I'll see you guys in the room.